Hello, geeks, gamers, and hello, nerds. I am with Callum from nerdemic.co.uk. Tell us about Nerdemic and what you do here in the UK. So Nerdemic is uh, very similar to what you guys do. We are a website, YouTube channel, podcast, live shows. Um, we used to be we used to be a radio show, yes. uh, which we cover everything geeky and nerdy in pop culture, so TV, film, anime, video games, comic books, and, and everything else that we feel is bringing forth geek culture to the, the masses. Force. <laughs> bringing forth the, <laughs> bringing force. Force, the force of. <laughs> geek culture to the masses like you at home. That's a massive tongue twister for you guys. Out of curiosity, you asked me earlier what my fandoms were. I said wrestling, right. I said Marvel. What are your fandoms? Um, that's a really easy question. Star Wars, Doctor Who, Marvel, DC, Pokemon, like a couple of animes like Attack on Titan and stuff. It's the only one I actually like. It's <laughs> 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 nice. Um, I have so many. Uh, just look through our YouTube channel. That's, that's all of them, basically. I, I make videos and a lot of my fandoms because it's very easy to do your own sort of work. Yeah. Uh, if you get if you look at what my office looks like, that's why I do a few of my shots. It's covered in posters. It's like, f like that's my 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 background is just okay. posters, and it's just full of like all the different fandoms I'm into. Uh, classic gaming, a lot of retro sort of. Uh, Nintendo stuff or Atari. What's your favourite retro game of all time? Or give me your top three. Top three. Uh, Legend of Zelda Link to the Past. Yes. The original Space Invaders. Yes, I love Space Invaders. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> Brilliant game. And uh, what's it called? I'm trying to think what's its official title. Yes, yeah, let's go with um, Legend of Zelda Link's Awakening. Lots of Zelda from this man right here. You're a wrestling fan? You ever been a wrestling fan? I have been a bit of a wrestling fan. I'm not as big as you are. You definitely trump me in that. My, uh, a couple of my other presenters are big wrestling fans on Nodemic, but I've seen it myself. I was forced... Uh, my, my brother, my little brother are big fans. They went to some of the bigger events recent, recently they did in London and stuff. Uh, didn't buy me a ticket, but... <laughs> but it, wow. I've seen it. I, I'm not up to date. So, like, the storylines are happening when I was watching it, like, a year ago was, like, the last time I proper watched it weekly. Yeah, you're out of the loop. I'm out of the loop. <laughs> like, is Daniel Bryan still trying to, like, win? Uh, it, Daniel Bryan's it, retired. What, what he, he, he's the commissioner or general manager of SmackDown. I don't know. That, that, that's just how, like, out of the loop. When I was doing, when I last time I was fully watching wrestling was when he was doing his big race at the top storyline. Oh, no, that's done, that's done. Down. That's all done. I just want to ask you some quick fire questions. Right, we, we Geeks Gamers community can get to know you a yeah, little bit more. It. So, what's your favourite game of all time? Oh, that's a hard question. I would probably say, this is kind of cheating. Is it Zelda but again? No, it's Pokemon. Okay. Uh, I can't name which one yeah. because... I love, I love them all. I love them all. I, I, I even like Gen 5. I know a lot of gamers will hate me for saying that, but I like black and white. Okay. So, what like about um, your favourite movie of all time? That's the hard question. <laughs> I can give you a top three. But, um, you have a top three, you have a top one. It's, it's, the, it's like... Or if there's a tie. There's a tie. Okay. okay. It's a tie between like a nerdy film and then just also just a, one of my favourite okay. films, uh, which is Star Wars, obviously. First one? Yes. Okay. But, it changes everywhere. At the moment, currently it's episode, eight, it's episode four. Yeah. Last week it was Rogue One. Week before <laughs> Rogue it was. Rogue One is incredible. It's such a good film. Uh, and then the, the tie with the other one is uh, Scott Pilgrim vs. the World. Okay. They are very different films. They are very different <laughs> films, but I'm just a big fan of Egg and Wright. So. What about TV? What's your favourite TV show uh, currently I, or. Of I all would time? say Doctor Who. Doctor, Doctor Who? Who has been my biggest fandom for a long time. Favourite wrestler of all time? So I was a Daniel Bryan, but he doesn't apparently wrestle anymore. So. He's still be your favorite wrestler. Yeah, he was the one that I was. Triple H comes out once a year at WrestleMania, does yeah. his thing, and then goes back. He was on a leather jacket motorcycle in the last one, wasn't he? Yeah, he was. It was, it was awesome. It was a bit weird when he was the um, authority figure, and I'm gonna show up like a leather man. He's a degenerate at heart. Let's remember that. That's true. Um, comic books. What's your favorite comic book character of all time? Uh, comic book character of all time. Ooh, that's a hard one. Uh, I would probably say tie between Spider-Man okay it's a good one uh, and I would Nightwing are you excited for the Spider-Man movie I am very excited yes. I really do like how Tom Holland is playing the role how are you so happy for one of our own yes the new Spider-Man Tom oh. Holland from the West End to Hollywood well I'm a little annoyed that they didn't get me to do it I, I am myself basically the same age as him and also have an a, a acting background so Can you do his athletics 
that might be why I didn't get the role. <laughs> <laughs> I do have a cool story though, actually. Yeah. Uh, I was in the top three. I, w- I used to be a child actor. I was in the top three to play young Magneto in X Men First Class. Holy X Men bulls. Yeah. Holy mutant bulls. I had to go to an audition in London when I was like 13 to do the scene where he's in the Nazi like doctor's office yeah. with Kevin Bacon across the thing. You've got to lift the coin with his mind and they shoot his mum. Spoilers if you haven't seen X in First Class. Um, if you haven't, don't waste your time. Um, like, that's one of the best. I didn't like it. Did you not? I didn't like it. Oh, okay. I didn't, like, I didn't like anything past X-Men 2, apart from Deadpool and the Logan. Oh, okay. I cried three times. Everyone's allowed their Logan. personal opinion. I'm not one of those people who will strangle you for it, but... <gasps> I'll force choke you. No, I'm hey. I'll force choke him. One last question on. for you. Are you a sporting man? Do you have a sports team? What's your favourite sports team? <laughs> Uh, sports is where I, you drop me. Uh, wah, wah, wah. I would say favorite sport yeah, is sport. paintball. Paintball. Yeah, it's a paintball. Yeah, I like. I, I, I really enjoy those sort of sports that kind of gets you through action. So like paintball, Nerf, and airsoft. It's also really cool to. Fi- as a, um, I'm a freelance cinematographer, mm-hmm. so I love just seeing GoPros on me and just sort of going through <laughs> stuff, breaching rooms, and paintballing your mates. <laughs> Well, it looks like things are actually closing up here today. So I want to thank you very much. Guys, go check out Nerdemic, and we'll have more from Oxford Comic Con right after this. Awesome. Keep it nerdy, guys. May the force be with you. (laughs) 